What's up, YouTube? Old School Customs. Mr. Old School 84 coming to you with another 10 Customs I'm showing you today. First one, 1970 Chevelle wagon. Turned it into a hearse. Used putty to uh, cover the back windows and have the back door look like have curtains in the inside. Rear riders, detail. Seventy hearse, Chevelle, wagon. I'm right, gonna move on to the next one. I'm trying to keep them quick. The next one is my eighty Monte Carlo. It's the original paint. All I did was put some Maestro wheels on it. How I did it, cement glue, cement glue, painted the interior brown, couple details, and the rows. Eighty Monte Carlo. Move on to the next one. This next one was in my uh, a recent custom contest, Camaro edition. It's the '85 I Rock Camaro T tops, and you can see I also made people. It's two dudes in there. The passion that got his hands up, like his hand up. The driver got his hand on the steering wheel. I'm trying to see that. I used putty to do that. Rear riders. Also did the bottom. Full detail. Tail lights. Speakers in the back. What an amp. I'll do so. That's my 85 Camaro. Next is going to be these are well, most of these are all recent customs. My 37 Woody original paint. The body was blue. It was just a blue plastic. So you know, I used brown and tan to make it look like it got the you know. Make it look like it has wood grain. Headlights. Rear riders, tail lights. Also has a uh, brown interior. And it's my 37 Woody. Moving on. Next one. Is my version of the 2014 Camaro. It's the 2012 Camaro casting. But see how I gave it a little facelift, kind of make it look like the 2014, and also did the tail lights. Also did some rim design. And it has black and yellow. And you can see that right. Black and yellow interior. This is hand painted yellow. This is my first yellow hand paint job. So, came out, came out good. Also did the bottom on this. My version of the 2014 Camaro LS1. It is up for sale. I mean, majority of all my customers are up for sale. So you can hit me up on here or hit me up on Instagram. Ladies out the way. <clears throat> Next one. 
is my Scion FRS Slam a little camber just a little not extreme but just a little it's dusty OC old school customs tailpipes has tan and black interior with red seat belts is that uh metallic copper color Next one is another station wagon. All last week I've been doing a lot of station wagons. A couple weeks ago. It is now a 70 Buick sports wagon. She has the Buick front end on it now. Metallic green. You see it? Metallic flake green with brown interior, chrome around the windows, red line, rest, uh, rubber wheels, rear riders. It's my 70 Buick uh, sports wagon. Move on to the next. This is one of my early ones I did a long time ago. Long, long time ago. 86. Monte Carlo SS. Metallic silver. T tops. It's red. Interior. Silver seat belts. These are uh, M2, M2 uh, rail riders on it, and it does roll, it does roll. They just went a good while back, probably, I think this was my second one, I believe, second one I did. First one was that black one, that flat black one I did. I love these castings too. I always try to make my cars look, you know, realistic. I don't like too much tempos and decals on them. Something you'll see on the street. Alright, moving on to the next. We got two more left. Also did this one a while back too. What is it, 2010? The 2010 Camaro. I uh, did a lot of grinding to put these Maestro wheels on it. That was well, just a little bit, but yeah, it well. Um, factory paint, didn't mess with the paint, but just painted the interior black and put them big wheels on it and did detail, headlights and stuff. My 2010 Camaro. I know, uh, shout out to uh, Smooth Criminal. I know he'll like something like this. Yep, alright, got one more. This one, uh, still working on it. But I didn't think too many people would like it, but. I guess a lot of people did like it. It's taken outside of the box. 70 Chevelle wagon with the not only the Camaro front clip, but now is the fiber front clip. So I call it the Bandit wagon. Tan interior. I was going to do T tops on it. And I had to cut that brim if I did that. It was just probably going to look crazy. So I didn't do the T-top. But 
I can see the back. The shows in there. I got speakers all in the back. Got six speakers in the back. I ain't gonna show up. Hand painted the bird. On it. It's like Sally Fields version of uh, this is what she'll be driving <laughs> right here with her grandkids shout out to uh I had this idea a long time but it took me a minute to start it but uh my man Superman Isaiah um he did one he did a uh, Chevelle wagon with the Camaro clip on it so I like how his came out Fiber bandwagon. Um, that's all in all. I hope you enjoy YouTube. Peace.